I'm gonna selfie video this shit. Who gives a shit? And I'm gonna have a bit of a rant about nutrition because I'm just fed up of people making excuses and not getting the result that they deserve because they're not wanting to put in the work. I mean, for years and years and years, we know as scientists what you need to do to lose body fat. Why then are so many people out of shape? Why then do people find it so hard to actually make the food, eat the bloody food, and get themselves in shape? Well, I think it comes down to a couple of things. Number one's probably a bit of disbelief. You don't think that it's possible for your genetics to end up having a lean person's body. I mean, um, this is very common to not believe that you can actually be a lean person, have six pack abs, You've actually got to just lose the weight and not worry about what you're gonna look like at the end. You can't have the, the end not being good enough as the reason for you not to get started in the first place. Health and actually living a full, um, you know, long life should be the main thing, not dying young because you're worried about having some loose skin. Um, the other thing I think holds people back is the analytical side of being in a calorie deficit. I mean, you might have to weigh your food. Let's go in here. I think a lot of the time people fucking worry about stuff. Like, and it's not even a, a big deal. Right, here we go. We got some rice. I got weighing scales. And basically, if I want to weigh 100 grams of rice, I pour it into a bowl and I put it on the weighing scales. Done. And you know what's awesome nowadays is you can grab my fitness pal and you can type in rice search and it'll find some rice and you can type in a hundred grams and it'll show you exactly what was there. I mean, look at this, when I was 14, so this is 16 years ago, this is like before I had the internet and when I did have the internet it was like super slow. Do you know what I mean? We used to have to go in the back of this, can you see this? So this is food, grapes, one cup, the weight, 152 grams, is 21 grams of carbs. So if I wasn't eating 152 bloody grams of grapes, I had to convert it to one gram and then calculate how many grapes I was eating. And then it didn't go into my fitness pal, it went on a notebook and had a calculator and I had to work out every single day what my calories were. Now my fitness pal is like, blip, 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 done. Why wouldn't you do that? Why wouldn't you do what your coaches ask you to do to actually get in shape in the first place? I mean, there's so much information out there that I think that if you are not using it, if you're not using the, the apps and the technology that we have nowadays, which is phenomenal, then you've got to ask, do you actually want to be in shape in the first place? Do you just say you want it, but you're not willing to put in the hard work and effort to get what you want?